President Joe Biden speaking tonight at Miracosta College in support of Representative Mike Levin, who is facing a challenge from Republican Brian Marriott. KOSI's Matt Pritchard has more now from that presidential visit. Well, guys, President Biden spoke for around 47 minutes tonight at Miracosta College here in Oceanside in support of Representative Mike Levin, who is facing a challenge from Republican Brian Marriott in the race for the 49th Congressional District here in California. Groups like Politico have said that this race is a toss-up, and a lot has changed in the last few years because of redistricting here in our state, which causes the 49th District to perhaps be a bit more attainable for Republicans than it has been in past years. Now, in terms of what the president had to say during this particular speech, he went over a number of different policy issues that, of course, is important to him, like codifying the right to abortion, trying to create stricter gun laws, and maybe most importantly to him, to holding on to uh, power in the House of Representatives and the Senate after the midterm elections so that he can continue to push forward his agenda uh, in the second half of his first term in office. We, of course, were here live on the platform listening to everything uh, that he had to say. We picked out a few moments from that speech and also from Mike Levin as well. Take a listen. Here's the deal. Economic growth is up. Price inflation is down. Real incomes are up. Gas prices are down. We got to get them down further here in California. And exports are, all, exports are also up. The reason why exports are up is guess what? We've made 700,000 manufacturing jobs here in America just since I've been president. We're going into an election. And you have all these people saying they don't accept the outcome of the last one. And they're not guaranteeing they'll accept the outcome of this one. How does that, how does that represent anything remotely approaching a democracy? Look, the bottom line is this. We've made a lot of progress over the last 20 months, but it wouldn't have been made without Mike's leadership. The vast majority of progress made without a single vote from a single Republican. These last four years, you've seen our country experience changes and threats that you once would have thought never possible. That's why you're here tonight. You care. And that's where I need your help. We got just five days to go. And tonight, I need you all to pledge to join us at one of our campaign offices in Carlsbad or Laguna Niguel over these next five days to help us get out the vote. Will you help us get out the vote? And certainly, you can tell the importance that the 49th District has for the President of the United States, hoping that Mike Levin can defeat Brian Marriott. But again, that appears it is going to be a race we will be watching closely on Tuesday, November 8th. That is just a few days away. The president suggesting everyone get out and vote. Of course, that's something every American should be doing this time of year to have their voice heard in the midterm elections and take part in democracy. In Oceanside, Matt Pritchard, KUSI News.